Urgent call for help tonight. Wildlife rescuers have been flooded with an influx of sick and injured pelicans over the past few weeks. NBC Barry's Judy Hernandez reports that wildlife experts are trying to pinpoint what's behind it. The folks here at the International Bird Rescue in Fairfield have been swamped caring for pelicans. It seems the majestic water bird that was once on the brink of extinction has hit some troubling times again. They're a species that I think we all recognize and sort of it, it is it is the coast. Pelicans are the coast. It's what you see when you're you're sitting and enjoying a beach day. But this iconic bird is battling to stay healthy. Wildlife experts say they've seen dozens of brown pelicans pouring in, weak, hungry, and injured from searching for food. This is a brown pelican crisis uh, happening right here in California. This live bird cam shows the full house of pelicans being treated in Southern California, more than 200 since mid-May. And now malnourished pelicans are being found in the Bay Area. Three more arrived to the bird hospital just this afternoon. We watched as this bird, who was found on a Santa Cruz beach, got its first exam. Most of them have been coming in skinny, and this one is the same. It's dehydrated, it's emaciated. Thankfully, no other major medical issues, which is great. But what's behind the influx is a mystery. So far, no signs of avian influenza and no clear explanation for why they're starving. These birds are all incredibly hungry, despite signs in the ocean showing plenty of food is there. But there's no question that feeding so many hungry birds is costly. The International Bird Rescue Center says it's spending $2,000 a day on fish alone. That's on top of caring for the other species of birds that also need help. They hope people pitch in to help them through the pelican crisis. And they're all eating, they're all gaining weight, so hopefully with lots of food and medication, they'll progress. And in Fairfield, Jody Hernandez, NBC Bay Area News.